All right, so now we will continue with our daily quests from back in the beta days. Discover the source of the purple cape. So you have heard me say before in these videos that we used to find our cosmetics out in the world. There were little platforms, kiosks, where you could get them. And so the purple cape was added to Wasteland and it was right in the middle of the crow pit. And I'm not sure at this point, um, I'm going to assume it was there still at this point. Yeah, it would have been still there at this point where you got the purple cape. And I have a previous version of getting the purple cape, so a previous video. So there's our krill. And there is our platform. Oh. It's no longer here at this point. Okay, I'm sorry. It's no longer here at this point. So you could still get the quest by going here, but the kiosks are no longer here because we've moved on to the other way of getting cosmetics. The current way of getting cosmetics. So anyway, that's why I'm saying it's one of these places because I don't know which one it is anymore at this point, but I do have a video previously of where we actually got it. Yeah, and watch for dark creatures. Good, good suggestion there. Oh, wow, that's a beautiful view of him. Back then it was much easier to dodge them. Climb the prairie's broken tower. Well, the broken tower is still there. Looks a little different now. Oh, wait. So many versions of this game. Um, actually, I think right now it looks the same. Let's see. Um, it used to look a little different when we first got the quests, I think. It's been so many versions and going back and forth between them. But yeah, this is going to be the current, basically the current version, close enough to the current version. So that the Broken Tower is, I can't remember if it was either one of them or if it was a specific one. I, maybe I make a note of it here. Because this is my original videos where I did how-to videos for these things back in the beta days. Um, yep, yeah. they got it in that one. I'm not sure the other one would work. Find the forest wishing well. Now this is no longer there at all. It, the whole area has completely changed in forest, sadly. But this was a cool little thing people found and were really excited about when it was brand new. But then, of course, they've revamped forest completely since then. So this no longer exists. The area no longer exists. It used to be located directly above, or not directly above, but pretty close to right above the um, crab pit that is on the left. So there's a seasonal spirit tunnel um, where you got this gratitude seasonal spirit. The crab pit there that you have to go into and out of has a hole above it, or had a hole above it. That near that, that used to be the wishing well right there, actually. <laughs> My memory is foggy. Um, but it, that used to be the wishing well right there at one point. We're gonna skip ahead a little bit here. Um, this is the third area, and some of this stuff is still there and some of it is not. This is still kind of there. That's where the meditation spot now is occasionally. Um, so you go down the, the middle. This all looks different now. But you go down the middle and off to the left. Um, there's that little boat. It used to be the angry spirit over there. And it was right up above that. So that's what I'm trying to show here because then this was my how-to video for how to find it. So over off to the left, you see the little boat. And then this is where the angry spirit used to be. Now this is where the cave for the gratitude spirit was, is. But this all is completely different. So there's candles here. You go up the cliff on the left here. We had a funny way of moving. That's so funny. And there's the wishing well. That is not its original appearance either. It used to look a bit different than that. But there's the wishing well. And then next we have, visit the Wasteland's highest peak. Well, this was never the Wasteland's highest peak and it still isn't, but anyway, we'll pretend that it was. <laughs> but this is where you get the quest, which I think is why so many people needed help with where you get this quest is because it was not the highest peak. You can see the floaty, the floaty flying right now. 
our flying was very floaty at this point. Um, we had, we had um, so many different flight modes and that was the most frequent, but you can see the highest peak is directly ahead, but you can already see that there's a higher point over there. But anyway, um, our flight modes kept changing, our flight way of flight. And I think actually with this one, we had a little more flight power than we'd had before. Cause you can see my flight power is going down very slowly. So I can flap and flap and flap, which is kind of nice. It's, it took a little bit of getting used to the way it works now. Same place as you get the lookout emote. Still the same place you get the lookout emote-ish. Uh, you can see a message candle down there, but here we would get our quest. Woohoo! Alrighty, so that's the highest point. Now, fly with a light manta in prairie. We're still going from aviary. They had narrowed these gateways. When Aviary was first introduced, those gateways were really wide. It's beautiful. You get about six people through it with no problem now because you get three. Anyway, fly with a light man. So you can imagine where this is done in the villages area of Prairie. So first we have the old way, the old way uh, fields, butterfly fields used to look. Like I said, these uh, all these videos were done as how-tos during the beta when all this was relatively new. Well, these quests were around for a little while. Um, yeah, this still looks the way it does today. So obviously we have to um, activate the bells so that we can get the light mantas going. So we'll skip ahead to when I've done that. go we have light mantas or ginormous mount manta though not as big as we've seen now so we're just gonna go over find him and find the arrow that lets us grab on There we go. There is our quest. So that is all for the old daily quest. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching.